Welcome to Brother Frank TV Beautiful People. Today we are at the J.W. Cooper School in Pennsylvania and we are going in and have the place all to ourselves. Cue the intro please. All right, beautiful people. We are about to walk into the J.W. Cooper building. And we have been given full permission. We are here by ourselves, just closing the door. And here we go. Let's start to check it out and we'll head up this way, we're probably going to need a light. Good thing I brought one. And I'm going to put any and all info in the description box. Now, this building, here goes the auditorium. And this building used to be a makeshift hospital before, I think in 19... 17 or something like that to 1918 and then it became the school I think 1918 1919 and it closed officially in I believe 85 1985 or 1986 so we're right around the hundred year marker of this school here goes the original piano right here this is the original from what the owner had told me and he's a great guy his name is Kent I will leave a link in the description if you ever want to come here he's really cool I mean just such a great guy I mean don't come here and like try to get in on your own he's got now he's got cameras set up all over the place he may have been able to do it before but this is the right way to do it anyways and I mean it's really cool leave the guy a donation and you take your time I got the whole building to myself the J W Cooper school I've wanted to come here I know many youtubers have been in here and this place has had lots of people so it's now time for brother Frank TV and I'll take a peek in here this is where I think the supplies are so we'll just take a poke in there this one's locked up and well now here we go we got some graduating class of 1958 and here's some plaques and stuff on the wall so we'll make our way this is uh I believe uh he says that they get kids that come here and Actually, there's a little baby picture. And they give them um, computers. They give them computers, which is really nice. They're all fixed. And uh, that's really cool. So you can see they're kind of all over the place. And make our way around. It's dark in some of these places for sure. But here go some books. And just really great place to explore if you're in the area. I took me about four hours to get here. So, but for me, it's well worth it. And if you're able to get into the Pennsylvania area without a doubt I certainly recommend you coming here getting in touch with Kent for sure and uh, this one is locked right here yep and we don't go into anything that's locked oh there goes a TV
Pretty cool stairway here. And let's go down here. Take another look from this side. <clears throat> Auditorium is really cool. And here goes another piano that I believe he said this was donated. The original is over here, and this one was donated. And that's the original right there. And I'll take a peek over here. You can see some of the original sheetrock and stuff like that from here. Another view right here, right from the auditorium. Pop the light on. Here we go. Trying out a new light today. I usually use the cube light, but trying out a new light that uh, one of the companies had sent me to try out. So let's see what's cooking here. That one's locked. Pretty cool. And oh, here we go. Cool. I guess that's like an angel. And oh, there we go. I think he said that they they hold some of the stuff here for when they do the Phantom of the Opera, but. These things here are always on the creepy side when you kind of like just run into them and don't know <laughs> that they're right there. Next thing you know, you turn the corner and whoop, looking you right in the face. So, take another look here. And it's always a good chair and a place there. I'm sure, it's all set up for phantom of the opera but this this is just a tremendous auditorium and it's in good shape for being a hundred years old i mean let's face it this is in good shape for being a hundred years old it's always a little bit of a check out back here it's always a little bit of an eerie feeling when you're in a historic building oh and there goes another one that's a hundred years old you know I'm going to come back, uh, I'm going to try to set something up and come back here, maybe do a YouTuber collab, maybe come back here um, at nighttime with some, uh, some that want to come. I think this place would be really cool to um, check out at nighttime. So, all right, so we just came this way. Let's keep on track. And I do have my EMF meter going so if we see something that pops up I will certainly let you know but as of right now nothing going on and I do have it right there alrighty and there goes the room right here that okay alrighty and let me go oh Wow, it's a lot of, uh, I don't know, a lot of stuff in here. You know, you can see old classroom, ch the chalkboards, but this room has a lot of, I don't know, let's just call it junk. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> one. and here we go into another room where you can actually see the, here's a better look. But you can see the uh, the grass that started to come right through and grow in here. And you can see where it's leaking right here. And probably loves the fact that it's getting watered. <laughs> How do you beat that? Oh, 
Well, there's a interesting rope. Take a look from outside. Yep, and then you can see here some of the broken windows right here. They, you know, he's had to replace so many windows, cost so much money. And uh, if you met the guy, you would say, wow, what a sweetheart of a guy. Why would you want to do that? He's so willing to let you come in here. Why would you want to do that? So, okay, so now let's continue on this floor. We'll knock it out floor by floor. Here goes a room, kind of uh, classroom. A lot of stuff in here. Cool truck. Some suitcases. Yeah, classroom, for sure. Always get a good stuffed animal. Floors have a lot of glass on it. We go into another room here. Miss Cuff's room. <laughs> yeah, check it out. Yeah, desk. And there we go. Yeah, pretty cool. There. Oh, here you go, some that have been here. And here we continue. Oh, right there. <laughs> Alrighty, so, oh, and here we go. Got a bathroom here. Take a look at some of the bathrooms. So, Yeah, I'll tell you what, they're really not in horrible shape for being a hundred years old. I mean, I don't know how many times they've been repaired, but not in horrible shape, that's for sure. All right, so here we go. Check it out. Absolutely. Seems like they're around every corner. And then you come right here and you're right back into the auditorium. Oh, there we go, making our way now. Always a good chair. And let's go ahead and climb up. Take a look from up here. There you go. A lot of stairs. All right, here we go. And I think I got spun around. Some of these rooms look exactly alike, but not sure. But it's always a good chair right there. Moving right along. Yeah, there's some more jump. And here, the door's like kind of glue. Seems like. There's, actually, here's a ladder that takes you right up to the roof for anybody who likes to go up there. That's uh, not for me to do. The ladder's not that stable. Always a good chair. All right, here go the urinals. Right here, they're right into the ground. As you can see, and there we 
here we go. Here's a overview right here, overview of the auditorium, which is this pretty cool right here. Check it out. How cool is that? That is a really cool look right here. Let's check it out. Yeah, I'll tell you what, good shape. This place, for it being a hundred years old, is in good shape. Here's a really cool view right here. Definitely doing some work, laying some brick, without a doubt. And here goes some, maybe some chairs that just couldn't have been restored right there. For whatever reason, always a good chair. And it brings us right out to here. Here's a really, really cool view right here. Really cool. And puts us all up top for a beautiful view of this spectacular auditorium. And here we go. I know they're working here almost every day, if not every day. Goes a little comfortable chair. You get a little tired when you come here. A little peek outside and as we move along Whoa. all right somebody definitely needs a hand all right and here we go little horse is a horse of course of course Well, somebody was transmitting here at some point. Got a little shoe, some shoes there, horse book, a little golf ball, and yep, here you go, a little horse. Alrighty. Little pillow, little blue ball. This is the pool table. Kind of like uh, be a little common room, sort of. Maybe if you're really tired, there you go. Take a nice rest. <laughs> Alrighty, I think we're, oh, tell you what, that's in good shape, that, that drawer right there. And brings us right back out to the auditorium. And then that brings us to, this brings you back downstairs. Take a peek right here, pretty cool. Uh, we still have to hit the bottom floors. We're saving that for last. And this, uh, I think he said is a, conference room so yeah little conference room here pretty cool yeah nice nice table yeah nice table here um go to the other end just wanted to come check these stairs out and believe me there's 
20 of them. Okay, so on this side, yeah, we were on this side. So let's go to this side, which I don't think we got into. And then we have the downstairs. I think there's the pool and the gymnasium, which are really, really the big points. The pool and the gymnasium are the real strong points as well. They have a pool here that I believe is the oldest school pool in Pennsylvania. So we'll go check it out. I think it's got a lot of uh, dirt in it. And I think it about, goes about six foot four in total. But we'll check that out and the gymnasium as well. So. Oh, there you go. Big area there. And, oh, and here we go. Another one. Which is, yep, another bathroom here. Yep, check it out. Those have been ripped out. Okay, that's, <laughs> that's cool. And, Alright, even toilet paper there if you need it. Alright, sinks, and make our way. Alrighty, so, and this is, uh, the sink there, and the final room. Wow, now this. This is a little on the creepy side. The chair and uh, wow, that's interesting. Interesting room for sure. All righty. Making our way. We've definitely covered all this. And once again, just so we, this is where the ladder takes you up. Now we're going to go downstairs and let's go check out. Downstairs. And there we go. Oh man, poor birds didn't make it. Some of them come in and they can't get out. And what they probably end up doing is they go full speed in to the window, they break their necks, and that's the end of that. So let's go right here which I believe that this is also a floor that we've covered. Yep, so, yep, we've definitely covered here. Yep, that's the room with all the junk. So, yep, we've covered this, but let's do a straight shoot through here, which I don't think we've done. I think we've come from the other direction. Yep, and here goes the auditorium. From here, I'm gonna tell you, this is a really nice light. I gotta tell you, I think I'm happy with this light. Yep, and this takes us right to the bathroom. So we're definitely on, right on course. And you can see what I'm walking on here. And now it's time to go take a dip or play some basketball or let's settle for looking at it all right oh wow this, this one's got some lights on I don't think we've been here so. I don't know have we oh no this is the gym. All right, cool. Well, let's go in here first. Oh, yep. Some more of, uh, you could see the green growing in. 
right here and got a little cool truck and yep it's getting some water down here as well so it stays really moist in here as well so all righty here we go this is this is absolutely one of the places that i've been looking forward to seeing the basketball court or the gymnasium there you go it's got some got some basketballs lying down there it's got right here it's good all right and you can check it out see and I believe we're also gonna we definitely don't want to uh, walk straight and not look that's for sure yeah, that'll definitely get you boy all righty take a peek in here I think that's the room that he said is like the darkest to bring up light so yep, here goes some ropes and yeah this is i'll tell you what this is where they must have um because there's no areas down there to to watch the game so they must have all came up here who knows maybe there were some chairs uh during the basketball games and they must have sat up here and what a tremendous view you have here what a tremendous view to watch the game that's for sure and uh, now check out down here actually nice and cool in here definitely nice and cool in here so oh check out some of these rooms in here yeah extra tables maybe there's some oh and there you go that's always that's always really cool find right there that's an always the good old wheelchair no doubt about it yep the good old wheelchair and here goes it says meeting room and well, i guess so meeting room is yep it's got some oh yeah this is actually where he says help yourself to cake up i mean he's so nice he even tells you to have some coffee while you're here i mean so all you got to do is get in touch with him come on over and explore a really beautiful historic place that's for sure and uh there goes some others that have been here and there you go you could see it up on here maybe you're watching this video and you see your name that you put up there okay uh here goes a, a lounge wow so and models assistance so here we go so it's, well geez yep so this will be the rooms for where you would come get changed and i gotta tell you this you come through here at night time hmm. could definitely feel a little creepy with those drapes right there and uh here we go another board with some more names uh, yep there we go There you go, model dressing room. Yep, this is just a hey there, fella. Alright. Let's make our way over here. Do, 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 do. And uh, alright. Maybe another storage room here. Yeah, looks definitely 
this would have been storage or I think it could be where he's got his office. I'm not going to dilly dally in here too much. All right. Little cubby, cubby hole right there. And, uh, oh wow, here we go. Here is most definitely the other place that I wanted to make it a point to get to see. And this is the swimming pool that is the oldest high school or school pool in ground pool and the state of Pennsylvania is what I understand. So let's get a good look at it. We'll see what's cooking in here. This is a, oh, it looks like some old toilets and bathrooms and stuff. So here it goes. This is it. Here it goes. Got some dirt in there now. And uh, you could see the cool way to get in. If you see the ladder there, that's the way they would go in and out of the pool or I'm sure when it's full with water you can just dive in from over here especially if you love to swim much easier and then there you go six foot four and here's a bird's eye view of it right here so check out what's going on in here a little darker uh, yeah, not sure what this is. Oh, maybe a shower. <laughs> Always got that good chair set up in here. Right, yep. Another room here. So I'm just thinking these are probably all rooms for changing for the pool. Here goes games. There you go. Monopoly stuff like that. Okay, yep, there we go. There's the, there goes the good old wheelchair and we will continue back this way. It's very, very easy to circle around. That's for sure, no doubt about it. Alright, so there we go. Absolutely awesome. And now we're going to go into the girls' bathrooms or changing rooms right here. Very cool. Actually, I mean, these things are in really, really good shape. Cool design. And um, see what they got here. Um, unisex. All right. Again, it takes us right to that good. Wheelchair. All right, and here go. Yep, these are the showers. All right, so here go the showers. This is the changing room, and where they would come to shower. So, yep. Take a look at it. Yep, a lot of room. I mean, not not in the greatest of shape, but you know, hey, I'm sure it can be you know made to look good and i'm thinking that um kent is gonna bring this place back to life and you know it just takes a lot of money and uh for a lot of tlc and uh you know so if you come in instead of trying to come in and getting in trouble you know get in touch with them have them bring you here get a little donation to the guy and to the building and it helps out. It helps out a lot. And believe me, you're going to feel so much better than just coming here on your own. You're going to feel much, much better. Okay, so we did that. Now, there's, oh, that's the, yep, that's back to the gymnasium. And now we come back here where he said you better have your light on back here. So here we go. And, yep, there goes the gym. There you go. Ooh, there's a sign you don't want to see, but 
Um, that's okay. What we're doing here. Plus he said the building is free from that. So here we go. And uh, this takes us back down, but we'll go back around the other way. There we go. We'll come back out and check this out this way. Well, if not, you gotta hop over everything. So, all right, so we're getting there. I think, yeah, you definitely bring a light with you if you plan on coming. Don't rely, even if you come during the day, because it's during the day. Now this right here is now closed off, but on the other side, they used to be a top. That's not, you're not able to go through there anymore. That would have been the icing on the cake. So we're pretty cool. You've got the pool right here. There you go. Beautiful look at the pool. And then you come right over here to the gymnasium right here. Very, very cool. So, but before I forget, beautiful people, be sure to smash that like button. Smash that like button, beautiful people. Please like, please comment, please subscribe. Smash that like button, beautiful people. We got so many places, so many places still to go. Hit that bell. Definitely hit that bell. You definitely don't want to miss the videos that we got coming for you that much i can tell you so now we will start to make our way down yep here we go oh bicycle here we go take a peek down there we're not gonna be able to get through there all right here we go oh yeah that's the gym floor how cool is that Got a little bike, and wow, check this room out, holy moly, take a peek in there, yep, over here, it's an old mattress back there, and uh, you know, um, this is just a, a mess in here, and uh, uh, yeah, I don't know, let's take a look here. Yeah, we were able to take a peek, but here goes a mattress right here, as you can see. All right, yeah. Yep. The whole floor here to walk is very, very difficult. All right, beautiful people, here we go. We are now. Let's check out over here for a quick second. And we are now making our way. Let's take a peek in here. There we go. All right. All righty. And here we go. We are now on the court. All right. Here goes some of the books. Right here that they were able to salvage. Some of the books that they were able to sal salvage from back in the day. And some of the stuff. Yeah. Wow. Here we go. <clears throat> we're playing basketball. We're playing basketball. If you come here with a friend, you can even shoot a little hoop. Nothing wrong with that. That's for sure. There you go. Got a little ball. And take a nice jump shot. And it's good. So. And let's check out. Yep. And as a matter of fact, here we go. This is where all the clutter was. That. Yeah. Here you go. Here's the door right here. And that was what we were just, where we just came from. And here we go. We pretty much have gone through the whole J.W. Cooper building. Beautiful people. So I am definitely going to start letting you go. I'm going to start letting you go. 
and there's some rims kind of like an ABA basketball right there the blue right there the blue white and red what a great explore I really hope you enjoyed this video beautiful people we've got so many more coming your way so that'll I think we didn't I don't think we missed anything nope I think we got it all yep I don't see any other that we haven't gotten so we will oh. definitely get a nice workout and there we go there's a completely window that's just completely out that's a shame what a just what a great guy and that's a shame for that stuff to happen but anyways beautiful people just come back up top for another view and we're gonna finish up this video and get you some bonus footage. That's what we're gonna do. All right, beautiful people. I got some bonus footage for you. Here we go. And here we go, yep. Here we go, and this is bonus footage right in here, where he definitely said you, uh, you need your light, here we go. And here's the only existing locker that they have left. Here we go, and this is, here we go, and we can take a peek here at some of it, right here. We can see some of that. And some of that and this is the last remains of a locker that they have I thought that would be cool completely cool to throw this in the bonus footage here you go you got some some books and uh, some paperwork and all kinds of stuff in there so that's 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 pretty amazing in its own right to get a locker from back then so that is most definitely wonderful bonus footage and again I hope you've really enjoyed this video as we now get ready to close this vlog I'm not sure if we've seen here but even if we have we'll take another peek uh, as we make our way out of the J.W. Cooper School. But for now, that's all I got. Vlog is over.